Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Jabba Damazo Mystery Box. Um, been a little bit since I could do this again, um, but I got a little pack of games here again, and, uh, most of these look like horror ones, which is pretty fitting. I mean, Halloween's coming up and all that jazz, so let's go ahead and take a look and enjoy a little spooky edition of this. Okay, so the first game we got is called Hello, Hell, Oh. This is a bit of a... I actually remember this one. This one was popular some years back. It's really short, though, if I recall. I don't really re recall much that's even in it, but it seems perfect for this, for those who haven't seen it. I know, see you, I guess I know, is new game. Oof, really loud. I'm very slow. Okay, I can run. Okay. End 18. Approaching footsteps. Alright. So this is going to be one of those games where touching anything triggers an ending. Drink, drink. End 23. Hangover. Alright. Hey, there's a letter there. That wasn't there before, right? I'm lonely. Aren't we all? There was a little flash of something on screen, wasn't there? Not willing to turn on the TV. Maybe you should. Fireplace, rare these days. My phone's going off. Dot, dot, hello? Dot, dot, dot. Dot, 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 hello? Who is this? Dot, dot, dot. Akari? End one. Hello? Hello? Hey! There's something new on the title screen. Okay. Okay, I guess I just walk on the bed. I didn't even press anything. I just accidentally walked an extra step there. Just let it be morning. End four. Oh, now I start in the bed. What happens if I walk onto the bed again? Yeah, okay, just it continues. Same thing. Why you gotta be like that, chair? Why you gotta be like that? Did I actually have a clock in here? Did I? I don't remember that, actually, now. Phone's going off again. Dot, dot, dot. Hello? This is Akari, isn't it? Answer, please! Dot, dot, dot. There's something behind me. That's not good. N7. No reply. Hey, where are you? I'm standing right behind you. Did I... I didn't have a carpet. Feels almost alive. Go with the window. Oh, jump scare? Uh, hello? What are you? Some kind- you look like- I can't see the top of your hat, but I- I- you look like a red cl Red Klansman? Oh, hey, it's a yellow one! The Klansman Rangers. Hey. I don't want to look at the book. I want to look at the flower. How about you cut that out? Decorative flowers. Okay. What? Did, so stuff fell off? Pack with souvenirs for my girlfriend. Why did they fall down? That moved again. Not in the mood to read. What is the flowers doing? They're going into the wall! That startled me. What a waste of good wine. Maybe clean it up? Purple Klansman. There's so many of them. 
pack with souvenirs from my girlfriend. Why did they fall down? That's just gonna keep moving, ain't it? What's this little stain over here? Food? Yeah, sure, let's eat it. What could go wrong? Eat the food. End eight. Not feeling well. Okay, nothing changed. I don't hate you. Do you? Why is it lit? It's lit because it's hot. Feels almost alive. That table just needs to stop. Yellow fella? What are you really supposed to be? I, I, every time I look out the window, there's just a new color of them. Reflects the room. The mirror broke. Blood sticks to the mirror. Rooga booga. Not in the mood to read. The chair says no. Why are you blocking the exit? Not cool, decorative flowers. Okay, so clearly I'm supposed to figure out something. Smartphone, I don't use it much anymore. Lies. I like how this guy's got li just left candles going in his house when he got home, or while he was out, rather. But he's got a smartphone in a fireplace. Hey! What gives, Bear? You got something you want to say? Didn't think so. That's right. Go back to your corner. N2. Can't stand this room. Can you blame the guy? There's some creeps outside in the window. Oh, look. The bear is, is, is headless. Its head is off. Oh, good. Who is it now? Dot, dot, dot. Enough of this, okay? Please. And nine, unseen force. Now there's a wait there. Hey, where are you? Wait. <gasps> Music! Now you know things are getting real. Loud noises! Now you know things are getting real. Hang on a second. I just want to leave. Fleeing the phone. Ooh, the phone. Japanese horror loves smartphones nowadays. It's a weird thing to say, but like, I don't know. It's, 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 it's been so true lately. Kari, what do you want from me? Dot, dot, dot. All right, fine. I guess it's time to read. August 9th. In two days, it'll be six years of dating K uh, Kazuki. I'll d I decided I'll make his favorite meal. I'm sure he'll love it. Kazuki said he has an important business trip tomorrow, and I was already all done shopping. I can't even give him my presents. Well, today makes six years, Kazuki. I know work is rough. I was too harsh on the phone yesterday. I'm sorry. Kazuki called to say he'll be back tomorrow. It feels like it's been so long. I'd better meet him at the airport. The entry's in here. Ooh, I'm sorry, Akari. I'm sorry. Are you? You are Kazuki, right? I guess. N10, Sweetheart's Diary. Wait for me. What if I don't want to? What if I got things to do? The room is a different color now. What is the significance? There weren't... Were there blinds on this before? Like, of course, the animation has blinds, but I'm talking about on the actual little map here. What? Wait, hey, why you gotta be like that? That was blue candles. What do you want to do to me, Akari? Ooh, purple girl. I'll come to meet you tomorrow, Akari. Finally? Why not just come and meet me now? N15 notice. I'm coming. Ooh, spooky, scary. Ooh. Oh, is that you? Come in. It's time for our date. There you are. So how you been? 
Sorry I couldn't clean the place up. Oh, you're feeling a little blue today, are you? I... Hug? Akari, come here. Everyone needs a hug every now and then. Right? I won't let you be alone. I'll do whatever I can. I won't leave you. Really? Yeah. Really? Really? Really, really. I'm glad. She returned to normal. That brightened her up. Happy end. We're together. But she's, she's clearly like a ghost or something. You've passed on. I know. I guess, oh, okay. Okay, the game closed. Because I couldn't click the other option. There's, there's gotta be more to that, right? Let me, let me open that up again, okay. It's backwards now. Oh, lay, ole. Oof, that's a new kind of game. And uh, now I'm playing as the girl. Yes, I can't open a menu, just realizing that. What happens now? The curtains are drawn. Yo! Bad end. Unringing phone. Why, why you be like that? Why you gotta be like that? What? Fireplace connects to the mirror world. Does it now? Hello? Will do this do anything different now? Hello? Who is this? Oh. Kari? Okay, it's just repeating that other... Yeah, I've seen this ending before, haven't I? End one, hello, hello. Wait for me, I'm coming to see you. I know. Deep. Wait, this is new. Hang on. This is the Daily News. Yesterday morning, a woman was run over by a car. Seriously wounded. She passed away this morning. It's news from last month. Whoa. N6. Last month's news. Okay, the story's coming together. I wonder if there's anything else we can do here. Because obviously if I go to the fireplace, I'll trigger, uh... That other world stuff, but, um... I'm curious what else I can do. Entries end here. Sorry, Akari. The fire is blue. Forgive me. Ah, trap. Okay, so if I wait long enough asking for forgiveness... We gotta try and see every dang ending is what we gotta do. So if I just wait around long enough, like I've run in a circle, maybe... No, 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 I didn't. Ah, I touched the bed. I touched the bed. Once you touch that soft, wonderful mattress, you just go to sleep. I wish I could fall asleep that easily, but I cannot. All right. So I'm just going to run back and forth. Hey, hey, you move in my wardrobe. That ain't cool. N12 mirror. Okay. That's a new one. Is there a benefit to getting every ending, though? I'm wondering. Okay, no, okay. Even when you check the mirror after it moves. Okay, the TV turned on. I want to just walk around, though, and see if I can make the, the fireplace turn blue. Head is off. What if I blow out the candles? Why it's blue? I get a blue screen is what I get. And what was that? N20! It hurt! Dubba D dubba die, did that hurt? Alright, let's try this again. Okay. So I'm assuming checking the fireplace right now would send me to the other place. There we go, but I want to see what happens when I check it when it's blue. Why is it lit? Why is it lit? It's not doing anything great. 
Okay, so if I check this again, this lets her in, right? What if I pick a different option? Tell me the stuff. You're blue, Akari. I... Uh... Scold! Akari, I'm not dead yet. I'm alive, I have a future. I love you. Won't you put your soul to rest? That's gonna be a no, bo n no, bro. Bad end. Poor communicator. Ugh. Women, am I right, fellas? You're just trying. You're just trying to live your life, and even from the grave, they gotta murder you. Uh, what if I check the room when I, when I let her in? Okay, I'm I'm too curious. I know I I have an entire other thing to check out, but. I need to see every possibility for some godforsaken reason. All right. Akari, I... Check the room. She's gonna be like that. What if I leave while she's here? That's what happens. Why must you run? Bad end. You've passed on. Well, I guess I gotta close the game again. And now it's in mirror, mirror mode again. Oh, it's like when you beat all the tracks in Mario Kart. You unlock a new thing. Hey, yo, yo! I didn't even get a chance to do anything. Come in, come in, girl. Please, by all means, come in. We're gonna have a wonderful time, I promise. It'll be great. Bum bum, Akari, I... Is there anything else I can do in this mode? Because I've been confused as all hell. Uh, if I check the phone again... Why does Akari keep calling? It couldn't be! Wait, what? What? Hello? Akari, listen! I'm not dead. Not yet. I'm alive. I have a future. I love you. Won't you put your soul to rest? Huh? What do you mean? Oh. Bad end. Wrong number. Okay, cool. I just found another bad ending. Okay. Open the game again. Okay, it's in mirror mode. Will this change it? Can I finally go through this without dying? He's not... Oh my god, he's not there. Finally! Hello? Akari, listen. I'm not dead night. Okay, I had to trigger that so I could see this conversation. I see. I'm alive. I have a future. I love you. Won't you pick your, put your soul to rest? Huh? What do you mean? Them be some decapitation noises. N25, hello, Akari? Ooh, ooh, all right, progress, finally. Hey, where are you? There was a clock in here, wasn't there? Not willing to turn on the TV, no one ever is. Curtains are drawn. Did I have a clock? Blood sticks to the mirror. Curtains are drawn. Not in the mood to read. Let's get drunk. Hangover. All right, we're in business. Hey, what happened? Teddy bear. It feels almost alive. Hey, I know tomorrow's... Hey, I know tomorrow's our anniversary, okay? But I certainly can't just go wherever I want. Why can't you understand that? I don't get it. Not one bit. I mean, I've never missed it before. So I'm not sorry. And this isn't funny. N17, quarrel. Okay. Teddy bears. Fireplace, rare these days. What it mean by the fireplace connects to the mirror world if the fireplace doesn't do anything? What if I just go to bed? Bedtime! Just let it be morning. That's the same, exact same for Kazuki. 
Blow the candles. Something's approaching in the darkness. And it's spooky. It's scary. It's end 18. All right, so what do I do next? What if I just leave? Hey, Mr. Bear, how many times are we gonna go over this? Good for you, Mr. Bear. Don't lose your head over this. Can't stand this room. The bear is decapitated. Its head is off. Oh, great. Look who's calling. Kazuki? The call I got. It was from you, right? Enough of this, okay? It's not doing any good for us. N26. Unending. Ooh, wait. Who is it? Well, the phone rang as I was leaving. Nothing I can do about that. Fleeing the phone. I wasn't fleeing the phone. The door rung. Smartphone, I don't use it much anymore. Oh, phew, no, okay, there it goes. Dot, dot, Kazuki, what do you want from me? All right, we're going through the exact same stuff again. In two days, it'll be six years of dating Akari. I suppose I should treat her to a special meal. I bet she'll love it. Akari said she has an important business trip tomorrow. What a shame. I had a present and everything. Today makes six years, Akari. I know work is rough for you, too. I'm sorry for what I said on the phone. Akari called and said she'll be back tomorrow. I felt It felt like so long. I should meet her at the airport. The entries end here. Literally everything just reversed. I'm sorry, Kazuki. I'm sorry. N10, Sweetheart's Diary. Wait for me. Now what? Decorative flowers? All right. What do you want to do to me, Kazuki? Hey, there's a note under there now. I'll come see you tomorrow, Kazuki. Deja vu. I've been to this place before. Notice. I'm coming. Okay, so this looks like the finale mode. Or finale mode, more like the end end game. Okay, so let's let Kazuki in here. Dot, dot, dot. Stop, Kazuki. Oh, I don't even get an option here. Akari. Is that you, Akari? Cough, cough. Akari, hold out your hand. Come quick. Wait. The fireplace. Where are you? Quick, grab my hand. Is that Kazuki? Is it really? Really? I said hurry. That's what the letter meant. N28, another lover. Hello, hello? I know. So is now, what if now I have to go? Fireplace, rare these days. Fireplace connects to the mirror world. Okay. So I do this again. Hello, who is this? Who is this? You have the wrong number. I'm very confused about this game's plot. Wait for me, I'm coming to see you. All right. Checking the fireplace does nothing. What if I let her into the room? Then I check the room. Will that allow me to, uh... Will that allow me to activate the fireplace? I'm confused. Akari, I... Check room. 
Okay. That scream, Akari. Akari? Is that you, Akari? Cough, cough. Akari, hold out your hand. Is that Kazuki? It really... I said hurry. What even is this game? Don't let go, I'll pull you up. Kazuki. Heave. Akari, let's get out of here. Right. What? What? Okay. I mean, I guess th their ghost versions get to be happy together. Um. That is, when I heard Akari, I desperately reached for her. To save an Akari who shouldn't exist. The girl whose hand I'm holding now, is it the real Akari? That question didn't seem to matter. That's the ghost talking. What? Okay. Okay. That's a that's an interesting little ending. I I, I kind of like this concept. Even though looking at it as a whole, I'm thinking back on it, I'm immediately just like, what? But this that, that was cool. I'm I'm happy for the characters. I kind of want to see what happens to them after that, though. Like, how does their how's their new life go after uh, basically being different dimension love lovers now? True end, mirrored lovers. Thank you, game, for giving me a better idea of it. The ghosts get to be happy. The living versions get to, get to be happy. I wish for your happiness. Well, that's that's nice, game. See ya. What happens if I open the game again? Is it gonna be a jump scare? Hello, hello. Okay, it looks like it fully it's fully reset completely. Not even the the letter is there to tell you about the uh Yeah, the mirror world. Okay. Okay, I like that a lot. That was fun. So anyways, um up next we have a game a little horror game starring good old Waluigi, so let's take a look at that. Okay, so this game is called Forgotten Waluigi.exe. Looks like it'll be a fun, spooky time, so what's not to love about it? Let's find out. Black screen, and he's falling. Falling through the space. Sleeping well, Waluigi. Good. Are you dreaming? What could you be dreaming of? Your own spotlight? Your own fame and fortune? Or maybe, maybe your dream is darker. Maybe your dream is not for your own happiness, but instead to see others suffer along with you. I can help you with that. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up! Jump scare! Wake up, Mr. Waluigi. It's time! Okay. And, oh no. Really? Oh, come on. I can't use the arrow keys or nothing. Oh, boy. This sure is some movement, all right. This is the future of gaming. The future of point and click. Need a key. Well, I'm glad I walked that direction. Guess we'll try the other one now. I'm gonna walk back and there's gonna be a jump scare. Oh, look at that, look at that, call it. That must be the key, I hope. Pick up key. All right. How many clicks does it take to walk forward a few steps? I guess I can go inside the castle now.
We'll get there eventually, don't worry. I promise. This is, yeah. Yeah, we are, uh... We're, uh, Waluigi, and we are, uh... We're walking, all right. Bye. Welcome, Waluigi. You must be wondering where you are. Why? It's Bowser's castle. Where is Bowser, you ask? Dead. It was necessary so that we can take revenge. Revenge upon the world. Revenge upon all who towered above you. If you should suffer, so should they. Today, your body is mine. You will do everything I ask of you. And together, we will bring the kingdom to its knees. That sounds wonderful. What could go wrong? Kill Mario. <laughs> <laughs> and I will release you. You will find him at Peach's castle. Do not return here until he is dead. Really? <laughs> okay. Okay, I, I guess. What if I want to go somewhere else? Like the haunted house? You know what? It takes a little too long to make detours, I think. So let's go to Peach's Castle, like they told me. We've got distorted music. Enter door. There he is! I think he's in the hall, though, because I just came through that door. Just keep going forward a bit, and I should see him. your door. Okay, he's not there. Let's look at me forward. I don't know. I'm a little disoriented. Look through window. Appears to be a pipe from the underground. Leads directly to Mario's room. Okay. I think maybe if, if there was a little bit more, uh, if the movement was, uh, not the worst thing ever, I might be a little more into this, but we're gonna keep going. Let me look through the window on that, then. I gotta wait for it. I gotta wait for the arrows to load in. Listen. Where could Peach be? She was supposed to be here by now. Oh, that's more of a Luigi. What am I doing? I hope she didn't get lost in the underground. Maybe you should go check. Look at that. Enter door. Hold on there. This is Mario's room. He isn't accepting any visitors, so go home. Maybe I could just kill the toad. I could do that, but apparently I'm not going to. That would make no sense. Why would I do something like that? Let's just click, 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 click indeed. I left. Underground, okay, the underground's a location on the map there. And your pipe. Halt! The princess is in looking for mushrooms underground. For her safety, we cannot let you in. 
Unless you can get Luigi for us. He's been missing for several days now. Last we know, he was at that haunted house. Find him and we might consider letting you pass. All right, now we gotta go to the haunted house. I guess I was right to try and go there in the first place. It's all a big trading quest, I guess. We need to go to Yoshi's house, haunted house. Okay, it seems like this game does have a bit of work put into it for what it's worth, but this uh, this movement, like air quotation marks, is, uh, why? Just why? Oh, wait, I can look through the window. Up, down, up, I don't know. That's for obviously for a puzzle. Dang it. Figured that exit, but I had to be sure. Uh, can I not enter the house? No, I cannot. I can only look through the window. I don't get it. Was there something that told me what I was supposed to do here? Because if there was, I certainly missed it. Maybe I'll look at Yoshi's house. Yoshi's house could probably have the answer, because I haven't been there yet. This is Yoshi's house, all right. A perfectly acceptable version of Yoshi's house, I might add. Enter door. What happened, Yoshi? What's going on? You want to talk about it? This is not what I was expecting when I went here. There's three pedestals in the... Oh, key I need here. Need a key. What's going on here, Yoshi, my boy? Why is the thumping getting... Ugh! Okay, that startled me. Okay, you got me, game. I'll give you that. Okay, that was good. It's okay. I'll, I'll let him have. I'll, I'll let him have that one. But let's look faster. Unfortunately, speed is not the name of this game. The game has to load every option available to me. If I just don't. If I just go the wrong way, it's just, just, just it. Oh, fuck. That is legit creepy. I, I do like this. I do like this area. Ugh, dead end. A little trial and error, though, isn't it? Dang it. Yeah. How many- I, I, I can't do- I can't get out of there fast enough. That's so damn slow. Literally has to load the options for me to go left and right. All right, let's try again. Whatever, it's fine. I do like the concept, though, of just, like, this giant Yoshi eating you if you don't get out of there fast enough. That's cool. Good, good job, Dev. This is- okay, I will say this. For a .exe game, this is definitely pretty cool. But, I th th my biggest gripe with it is just ha the movement here, like, why? This just, I don't even understand why this is here. Pick up. Pick up. 
don't understand what I'm supposed to do. How do I even get an egg? Like, I, I know, I know how to get the egg. I mean, what do I do with it? What, what am I supposed to do here? That's what I'm confused about. Anywhere else I can go? No, no, I need to find Luigi, but I can't get into the haunted house for some reason. I think there's another spot I can look at in here, but we'll take a look. They wanted this to be point and click, that's cool, but maybe what they should have done is just have like a more zoomed out look of the map and I could just click on the doors and be like, yeah, I want to go here. But having it zoomed in like this and clicking the arrows every single time is really just, why? It doesn't seem like there's no way there's enough time for me to get an egg and leave. stomping this is Yoshi's story music by the way isn't it okay looks like I was wrong I got an egg what do I do with it though like is there a hint or something here because I'm very confused I'm curious, though. I, I kind of want to see where this goes now. The Yoshi's Island area, like, it, it reignited my curiosity. Well, I didn't, I don't, to be fair, I don't know if I had the biggest curiosity for a... Why have you returned? You must kill Mario. He is at Peach's Castle. Do not return until he is dead. Yeah, but I can't go there. They won't let me, dude. It's not like I don't know what to do. Try going here again. Like I picked up an egg. I don't think those things in the background are really telling me what I'm supposed to do to unlock the door. Are they? Hang on a second. Like I didn't get a prompt for the door before. Yeah, like I can't do anything. Go back again. Look through the window again. Is there a hint I'm just blind? I don't see anything. Not really. Like there's clearly a solution here, but I don't. I can't, I got it by randomly guessing. I don't know what I did. I just guessed, but I got it. That's gonna kill me in here. Place. Uh, that didn't do it. Where'd my egg go? Lost my egg. Wonderful. Orange, blue, purple. You know, I can just brute force it. Game over. Okay, no, I cannot. 
I'm on a timer, I guess. I still have my egg. Oh, great. I don't know what I did. Okay, it was like, like around that? Why is there a face there? Okay, so if I linger on the puzzles too long, the ghost face appears. That's what that is. I didn't notice that last time. Okay, let's try this again. I think I figured out what how to do it this time. Okay, there it is. That's the answer. I haven't got a clue though. How I'm how was I supposed to figure that out? I think I'm pretty sure I looked everywhere. I'm sure someone will tell me I missed something. There's no doubt in my mind. I might actually have to find the real answer for the next one though. Oh god, it's a maze of stuff. A library. Keep looking. Nothing. I've got me an egg, but I don't know what to do with it. There's a fire. Pick up the fire. Okay, so the, the fire is what I'm supposed to be placing. I guess it doesn't expect me to leave uh, the Yoshi's, Yoshi's place with the egg. I'm supposed to do something with it there. Can I pick up multiple fires? I hope. No, I cannot. This might be a bit of a pain to do. It's over here. Anything here? No, it appears it's just a dead end. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. Everything is fine. It's Waluigi time. I'm kind of lost. Mislead the entrance. What about over here? Why Luigi? He was chasing me. That's not good. So do I want this then? I don't know what I'm looking for, to be honest with you. There's red fire. Man, if the movement was so slow, I could actually uh, try and actually figure this out. But God, it's such a pain just to get anywhere. Nothing here. He's gonna be waiting for me on the right now, I guess. I guess. I guess that worked. Right is always right. Did I see something? I think I'm seeing stuff in the background. Okay, just keep walking. I'm not sure what you want me to do, game. Now the fire's gone. That's that puzzle right there. What? 
That's cool. I just, did I get it? I guess I randomly guessed it again. I found his ghost. Is that good enough? I really don't know with this game, jeez. They're gone. I guess I did it. I, I don't know. Let's go through here. We gotta kill Mario. That's the goal of the game, remember? Can't go in these pipes, I guess. We're just gonna keep walking. Walking is nice, right? Just keep going. One step at a time. Oh, great. Oh, great. That's what I want. I want to time movement in this game. Why wouldn't I want to do that? No, no more of that ever again, please. They're gonna do it again, aren't they? Don't see anything. Keep going forward. Keep going forward. We're gonna get there eventually, don't worry. I don't think there's anything there, but I gotta be sure. I don't wanna go back to the start, that's for sure. Anything else? Okay, looks safe to go through there. Ugh. Don't start on me with that crap. Trying to spook me. Okay, I think I reached the end. Hey, Peach, what's going on? You okay? I don't think she's okay. Hello, Mario. Oh, Waluigi, how did you get in here? Dot, dot, dot. Are, are you okay? Dun dun. Game made by Randy Becker. Oh, okay, that was it. Okay, well, I guess uh, my thoughts on this game are pretty obvious. Um. This definitely had some effort into it. It was a nice little thing, but I don't know. I just, yeah, the, I think the mo like the way they want you to move around in this is just, it absolutely kills it for me. Like it's just so unnecessarily slow. Like I think if you could move in this game, like normal, this probably would have been over in like five minutes. And I've been playing it for like what, almost a half hour. But it, for what it is, it's, it's a nice, yeah, blah, blah, blah. it's a neat little fun thing. I'm glad I got to see it. It's nice to check out little things like this. But anyways, uh, let's move on to what's at whatever's next. All right, so this game is called Resident Evil Escape, and it's from 2006, and is it and is a flash game. So, oh boy, we're gonna see some crust. If the title screen wasn't already enough crust, anyways. Oh, okay. Wait, wait, wait a second. Was that? That's the boy from Halloween. Michael Myers. Now, am I crazy? Okay, that's the Resident Evil Mansion. 
my supposed, uh... Am I clicking anything, or is this still a cutscene? A horrible stench of rotting flesh can be smelled. I can't... Do I have any control here? I, I don't know if I advance this or what. Okay, that... Okay, now I have control. What do we got here? You obtained a crusty key. This is Resident Evil like you've never seen before. The door is locked from the inside. I got the key. Good lord, what happened to my hand? <gasps> we got Moonlight Sonata playing right now. Meaty Sonata, rather. Right. Read Jim's diary? Dear diary, day one, I'm writing in the hopes of someone finding this and getting out of this place before it's too late. Earlier today, I was awakened by a sudden moaning and scratching sound coming from outside my room. Unfortunately, curiosity got the better of me, and I went to investigate. As I opened the door, a horrendous stench of what seemed like rotting flesh almost knocked me over. I followed it along the corridor where I saw a bloody figure laying in a corner next to the storage cupboard. I approached it, holding my nose in disgust. As I got closer, my heart sank in disbelief and horror as, I, as the figure appeared to be a decimated corpse. It was covered with what seemed like bites and scratches. It was in a horrendous state. Blood splattered all over the floor and wall. Bits of brain and skull were clearly visible. Where clearly visible. I paused for a second to hold the vomit in my stomach, only to be violently grabbed by the, by this, what I thought, corpse. I merely had a chance to... Th I merely had a... I think you mean barely. I merely had a chance to think before it bit into my arm like a starving wolf. I yelled in agony as it pinned me down and continued to, to munch into me. All over my body. Felt like I'd been ravaged by a horde. Of hungry animals, this zombie-like creature had superhuman strength as it held me down. Feasting on my flesh, this seems to go on, this seemed to go on forever. At this stage, I lost my voice, I still kicked and punched and scratched, I don't know how I managed to escape, but I somehow got free. I limped back towards my door, bleeding furiously on the way. When I got there, my trembling hands struggled to hold the key properly. I could hear the zombie approaching me as the moans were getting louder. My hands were still violently shaken as I tried to open my door. By the time I opened it, the zombie must have been yards from me. I locked the door behind me and collapsed on the floor, breathing heavily. The pain is unbearable. I knew it would only be, be a matter of time before I became one of those things. I knew what I had to do, but I couldn't do it. I'm ashamed at my coward cowardness. Cowardness? I think the word you're looking for is coward cowardice. Not to take my own life. God only knows what's gonna happen. Oh, God. Okay, cool. More diaries, just what I wanted. I don't know how I managed through the night. The intense pain kept me up. I can still hear the zombie scratching at my door at this very minute. My bleeding has stopped, but I've lost massive amounts. The wound cannot heal. The wounds cannot be healed. I am merely... I'm most certainly done for. I tried another attempt on my life today, 11.45 a.m. I can't believe how hard it is to pull the trigger. I can't sleep after the conclusion of my diary notes today. I will bang my head in the hope of becoming unconscious for another night. In this state, it will be too much to bear. Oh, I woke up in the early hours of the morning, the worst pain yet. I can literally feel the poison running through my body. I don't know how much longer I have before I turn. The one thing I do know is I can't take my life. That's something I cannot do. In the hopes of someone finding this, I would like you to do the deed when you see me here. I will not warn you again, for I won't be myself. I have a Colt Python in the bottom drawer. Take the key and do it. May God be with you. Jim, Prentice, Mansion, Caretaker. Neat. I got a key. You have obtained the desk key. In that Colt Python. Oh, yeah. Dun dun. Dun dun. He's moving. Oh, my God. Look at him. How do I do it?
do it. How do I how do I kill him? Headshot. Okay. Look at those teeth. Oh. That's some quality video gaming right here. Would you like to leave this room? That's the question is the answer apparently. I don't need to go back in there. This door has been unlocked. Enter. Sure. Hi, Michael Myers. What are you doing here? You're not a Resident Evil character. Oh, I died. I didn't click in time. The lights. I can hear him coming. I can't see a thing. Where is he? He's right there. He's getting closer. Can he see me? I better be ready to shoot. Okay, he's right there then. Where are you? Did I get him? You did! Okay. Um, okay, that's a... Continue from last checkpoint? Wow, this game has a checkpoint system. You honestly could... If you told me that at the start, I wouldn't have believed you. The door has been unlocked. Okay, sure, let's try this again. <sighs> Hi, Michael Myers. You're my favorite Resident Evil character. Forget about Mr. X, forget about Nemesis. Lights. Are we really gonna sit through this? All right. If I just mash clicking right here. Where it, where it is, right? That should let me, sounds like Dylan's home from work. Can he see me? Okay, guy, 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 I better be ready to shoot. Can't fail if I just click, right? Where are you? There, he went away. Oops, I didn't get to read what that text was. Boo-hoo. I better hold on to this. That's a bloody MS paint. It's locked. Maybe I can use this axe. I don't know, maybe you could. Why don't you? Use axe, there it is. Man. Video game graphics sure have come a long way. You obtained a large mansion key. You can see why PC gaming wasn't as big in 2006. Go back? Why would I do that? That's church. I don't have a key. Alright, let's take a look. What about this door? Ooh, a cellar. Should I go down there yet? It's pitch dark outside. There's a bed. This bed has been recently slept in. You unlocked it. You unlocked it. That's cool. It's bloody. A murder has taken place in this room. The bath. What is it? The bath if if full of bloody water. Oh no. Smeared in blood on the wall, there's some kind of satanic message. Yes, that's definitely the go-to symbol for Satanism. Uh, this bed has been recently slept in. Guess let's go down the... It's too dark to go down there. Well, maybe I don't care. Back. Can only go one way. I found a key. God, I uh, I hope the graphics aren't too intense. I might not be able to upload this video at this rate. Golly gee willikers, you don't have a key. Uh, 
there's got to be something else here I can click. That I'm not seeing. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, you can just barely click those. There are handprints of blood there. It's not going to let me do anything, though. I thought it was going to let me open it. Murder has taken place. I gotta hover my uh, mouse until I can find that sweet spot. It's one of those games. Uh, somehow this is still more of a point and click game than the Waluigi game was. Let that sink in. This bed has been recently slept in. Uh, can I check under the bed anyway? Can't look inside this thing. There's no way to click it. Oh, you, you just gotta find that one pixel. The one pixel where you find the item you need. It's pitch dark outside. It's pitch dark inside. Oh, I really don't know what to... I don't, I don't know what to do. Well, that's pretty much it, I guess. Um, I can't figure out what to do. Even when I look it up online, it doesn't work. You're supposed to be able to drain the tub, but the game doesn't work. I don't, I don't understand what I did. And then I kept going for a bit, and then the game just kind of crashed and went back to the beginning. And uh, I think we're done with that game because it's kind of a little poopy. Just, 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 just to use a few colorful words about it but anyways um i think we uh we got a little little a little chuckle out of that so let's go ahead and move on to whatever we got next all right so this is the final game that i have for the evening uh, i tried playing a couple other ones for this mystery box pack but they were uh they were unfortunately some pretty huge stinkers so we're just gonna end it on this this is called pass.exe and it was made by the same person who made the uh the Waluigi game we played a little while ago. <laughs> and it's a .exe game, so it can only be only go well. Okay, so I'm uh I'm on Death Mountain, as you can see. And surely only good things can happen when you're on Death Mountain. Like, you know, meeting Gorons, the Gorons. Why do I call them Gorons? Ins. Let's just climb to the top. It obviously wants me to do that. I'm going to climb to the top, and I'm going to get jump-scared. Turn back. Why? You going to make me? I don't think you are. Oh, no. Oh, no! The JPEG is faded into focus. The music has faded out. Ooh... Where's the loud audio clip? Ooh. Hi, fairy. Hero, do not be afraid. Please let me heal your wounds. You didn't heal my wounds. You did the opposite of that. Okay. <gasps> no! There's, there's blood in my Zelda game. This can't be true. Oh no, am I gonna find if I, am I gonna find a dismembered corpse at the very end? It's never good when that happens. Oh, the darkness is closing in on me. <laughs> I got spookied. If my name was Ben, I'd be drowned right now. All right, and ooh, there's a spooky thing in there. I can't interact with the spooky thing, but I can move forward at a slower walk speed. See, the slower walk speed is to build atmosphere, because right now I'm very terrified. I'm gonna get even more terrified because there's gonna be another jump scare in like. Yeah, they're gonna jump scare me right here. Just watch them. <laughs> Called it. Now I'm in a graveyard. This is not a game. And what is it? This is not a game. This is not a game. It's really a spooky, scary thing. This is not a game. This is not a game. Way to break my immersion. 
It's not a game. Not a game. Not a game. Let me guess, my name's gonna be on the grave. Here lies blank. Oh no! That certainly wasn't a game, all right. Wait, what does this thing say now? It's too late. I'll be the judge of that, mister. The spooks never end when .exe is involved. <gasps> the walls will ooze red slime! Alright, I'm just gonna move on. I guess I gotta go to the mountain entrance. I just noticed my item is that... Is that crusty fa is a crusty version of that fan art they've been using. Let's go. Ooh, that one did something different. Totally got me. Totally got me. And I left. And hey, what happened here? Hello? What happened to your eyes? Your eyes are gonna light up and you're gonna scream, aren't you? Hi! And then the game's gonna close. We'll do it already. I got all day here. Today! Boom. Oh, look at that, the game closed. Who saw that coming? Except everyone. <laughs> okay, God. All right, well, I definitely enjoyed the Waluigi game much more. That one was a bit more creative. This one was, uh... I don't know, I, I feel like I've played the exact same thing a hundred times. They're all, all these Dottie EXE games, they're all exactly the same. I wasn't expecting much of it, but well, we're gonna go ahead and end it on this one. Maybe I can do another horror pack, because there's still plenty of time, but... Uh, I'm not gonna have any more time to record for the next couple days, so I guess that's gonna be end of this episode for the Jabba Damazo Mystery Box. We got enough for a decent little little sized one. It's always fun to play a little some wacky little horror games. But anyways, thank you all for watching and uh, have a good night. Bye bye.